Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Arm Wrestling Simulator, where today we are here in the brand new Magic Forest World 10 that just dropped a few days ago in the latest update. If you wonder what's inside of this world, well, I already made a full deep dive video covering that because today we have our sights set on one fellow in particular, the Brute Killer. This is the new final boss, the new hardest boss in the game, as you need a whopping 450. 48 octillion strength in order to take down this boss and while as you can see above my head we're just shy basically by around a half of that strength on 217.8 octillion strength that we currently have and so today we're going to be getting all the strength needed to beat this boss and see just what kind of crazy rewards we can get from him because the new best pet in the game that is obtainable from these world 10 eggs this elder dominus right here as you guys saw in my last videos is absolutely insane because we were able to get one for ourselves the elder dominus 4.2 billion multiplier and this pet is super desired right now and so my honest game plan is to get this account up to a ton of strength be able to beat this boss and then hopefully get my alt accounts up to have enough strength so that way we can start opening a ton of these eggs and maybe honestly start selling these pets because they're just so rare but as you guys can see we have literally one of the best strength teams in the entire game and that's helpful because we're probably gonna need to get over 450 oc strength probably close to like six or seven hundred and that's because we don't just want to beat the boss we want to be able to crush the boss because if you have just a little bit more strength than is needed you'll you'll kind of be in this phase where this is the second hardest boss the fungi crusher we can beat him but it's still a little slow but if you compare that to let's say cyclops chris where we have like 10x their strength you're absolutely demolishing them beating them super super fast and so that's really helpful when it comes to getting more tickets and getting things like wins and so we're gonna need a lot of strength and as I found out in one of my most recent videos, this punching bag right here, the VIP punching bag, is the best way to get strength. If you don't have the VIP ability, the VIP punching bag, then this dumbbell over here is also a fantastic option. As you can see, we're getting 1.3 SX every time we curl this dumbbell. But I think it should only take a few hours. We should be able to get most of this done today. And that is due in part to some 3X strength codes that we have saved up. Every update, the developers drop some strength codes. And today, we're going to be using Magic World, maybe one or two other ones. But this should give us a... 3x stat boost for six hours so now we are getting i think it's two point yeah 2.2 sx every time we punch the punch big absolutely insane number so I'll, I'll check back in in six hours when our timer is up to see just how much strength we were able to get six hours later whoo that was a long afk session i think it was almost 24 hours and that's because i actually had a few difficulties with like disconnects and stuff like that but we're up to 623 octillion strength and the last time i had to do this in the underworld i think it literally took me days of afk straight with the barbell and again i just want to compare that so we're getting like basically one sx per punch right there and then let me go see with this we are getting not even one sx per curl every like two second so it is actually insane how good these punching bags are in world 10 so if you're able to get the world 10 use the punch bag they're absolutely cracked with 623 oc strength and if you remember we only need 448 so i think we have a relatively easy win ahead of us i am pretty curious do we get anything nope we don't we get a badge very nice but that wasn't with our winner winner team nor was it with our double wins potion so the full winner winner six team and with a 3x tap who's how many wins do we get we get 2.3 ddc which is pretty crazy because that means we can open two eggs at once every time we beat this boss now of course that's going to go down significantly to around 766 d wins which is still really good so basically every time we beat this boss we get almost enough wins to open up an egg but now that we have the ability to beat this boss i still think like this is a little slow for me like we have basically 50 percent more strength than the brute killer but let me let me time this and see how long this takes about five seconds start to finish where we get around 500 tdc wins per hour without the 3x boost because we could beat the boss around 700 times an hour so only getting enough wins to open up 500 of these eggs per hour seems pretty crazy because I, I i want to open up hopefully around 100,000 of these in a few days and so i think we still need to train a bit more strength but I mean, we have an hour left of this stat boost and it's just a little rough because i think an hour is probably only going to get us around like 30 or 40 octillion strength but we do have the ability to oh wait yeah there's trails 
still is 600 TDC, which that'll take about an hour of AFKing. So we might do that towards the end because that'll probably give us a pretty small strength boost. But this arm, we might be able to see if we can't find someone selling this arm because in order for us to max out one of these new arms, the magic arm, I think it has around a 6,700% boost. We could use tickets for this, but it'll just be really expensive, not worth it at all. And so I'm gonna go see if we can't try to find someone who's selling this and see, will this actually give us any meaningful strength boost? Because right there, we're just 100% boost. We get additional like 10 OC strength. So we should be able to get like 40 or 50 octillion strength by getting a slightly better arm. So I'll take it. It's the small little, little things. Well, I looked around pretty much everywhere in the Discord and asking around and I couldn't find anyone willing to sell the 6,700% arm for a reasonable price. And I say reasonable because this roll just came out and there's a really good chance that within, wait, did it just get lowered? Wait, they, whoa, they just lowered the price of this. Like a few minutes ago, this was 500,000. This was 300,000. Now this is 50,000. So again, this is probably going to be way easier to get because you need, I think around like 70 of these arms in order to get a max diversion. But now that's only like 3.5 million tickets. So even myself, I could, uh, dude, I mean, I could do it. It's just, do I want to do it? Ooh. I mean, you guys know I have around 15 million tickets right here. Oh, that's, that's a tough decision. I don't know. The only problem is this restocks every 20 minutes. And so buying 70 of these would take a literal full day. So I will get this best arm, but I just don't think I'm going to get it right now because if, again, we get probably such a small boost. We did get the 640 OC strength, but we're not done there because I think we're going to go ahead and chuck on our winner winner team and then get enough wins to get the best trail, the solitude trail. It'll only give us a pretty small boost, I'm sure, but we'll make sure we have enough wins potions and then go auto fight the brute killer. Again, it takes us about five seconds from start to finish and I think we'll have to beat him around like seven or eight hundred times in order to get all the wins we need so it, it's gonna take a minute so i'll catch you guys in a second whenever we have all the wins for this trail all right it's been i believe oh, two hours and we have 1.3 qt wins i'm also really curious what's up with the wins leaderboard because as you guys know a few days ago when the update came out we were number one in the world for wins and then that was kind of shortly lived because we spent them all on eggs but let's go see are we even top anything again holy crap 35 points 7 QT wins. That is actually insane. I mean, it's funny because that's only 35,000 of the best eggs in the entire game, but it looks like it might have just updated, but ooh, I actually, maybe? Oh, it only goes to top 50? To be fair, that would only take me a few more hours to get on the leaderboard. I also want to check now that we're going to be, we're going to be grinding a lot of wins over the next little while. We already have one of the pets required. We actually, oh no, we would, we would need to get top three five times to then make that pet because what is is it the elite is it elite anything what is the name again I, I i forgot ah the celestial garden yeah this thing right here this is the new pet they give out for these leaderboards and so i mean there is the possibility for for weekly wins oh 52.5 is that from lucky blocks this seems way more distributed so it almost seems oh we're almost top 100 which is kind of funny it definitely seems way more possible i mean this is going to reset in a day so I'm, I'm not going to be really grinding it that hard but weekly strength we've actually grinded quite a bit of strength we might be on here oh we have to definitely be on here right because we have 611 sp strength and that was all achieved in like the last few days but i don't i don't see myself what the heck maybe we're like right there oh my dude we're probably like 101st in the world for strength no way 140,000 in Boston. Who are the, the Q? What? Is this like one person? Wait, there's a bunch of their, those accounts. Weird. That's basically staying on for seven days straight. Oh my goodness. So yeah, as far as the leaderboard standings go, we got absolutely destroyed by going to World 10, but I, I'm sure we'll make it back up there eventually, but we can purchase the new trail. Let's go find that. It is the Solitude Trail, 580%. And I, I like how it's funny. They're still giving a speed boost. I'm gonna have a 242% speed boost after you purchase that there we go solitude trail was looking like dude i wish they came out with some like crazy trails because so i mean it, it's all just like different colors and that's supposed to be rainbow but it literally is like the one color what about the police is this anything different oh that's kind of cool see so, something like that I, I like those trails now i just have like a solid color and it's the most expensive one in the entire game like it does nothing all right anyways let's go train let's just go punch the punching bag once Ooh, 600 and basically 70 octillion strength Ooh, man what a grind let's go check 
check our stats as well. I, I, I'm gonna have to remember to keep doing this. Total grip strength. Oh, someone did say if I auto trained that it would give me like a better hand grip or something. It still only give me 300 QI per curl. And if I use barbells, I'm, I'm getting 600. So I'm not sure. Someone said I, I like just if I auto trained, it should fix itself, but it obviously didn't. Total wins 19.6 QT. Solid than eggs. I want to see that number get up there, but I, I doubt this is going to have to have made any difference at all in the speed we can time it again. Yeah, it, it basically made no difference. I'm probably gonna have to get to like one in strength if I want to, to be able to beat this boss any faster. I'm trying to think, is there anything else in the game that gives you strength? I mean, we, we've we used all the codes up to this point that give you a strength boost. Obviously, the arms are a little bit cheaper now, so that is a possibility. Not Rebirth, thinks I'll take away all of our strength. Nothing in the daily. Any, any spins? We have 1,700 of these spins. No, it doesn't seem to do anything. I wish there was a way. But I guess I'm happy to report that this challenge was a success. We've beat the final boss in the game. We beat every single boss technically in Arm Wrestling Simulator. And we have just a few wins left over. And you know what? We might as well have a little fun. Chuck on our luck teams. Chuck on all the potions. Maybe, just maybe, we can get a tad bit lucky getting one of these pets. I doubt it because they're so rare. But again, the next video coming out should be me opening 100,000 of these eggs. And so if you haven't already, make sure to subscribe to the channel so you don't miss that. But I'm gonna keep my eyes peeled, see if we can get anything. Uh, but keep an eye on things. I don't think we got any of the pets. Again, which is the whole reason I even got all this strength so I can get wins to open these eggs. So what is it? It's obviously the Elder Domin- Oh, wait, okay. I was like, whoa, we got it. Eh, it's the one I already had. <laughs> false alarm, false alarm. And then the Eagle, still shocked. We've opened around close to 20,000 of those eggs and got zero of the rarest drops, which is a little unfortunate. But thanks so much for watching today's video. There's still a lot of things we have to conquer in this world, namely maxing out this magic arm, which it's back up to 100,000 tickets, but I'm pretty sure they just lowered it to 500,000. So we should be able to get this arm maxed out and then hopefully get a full team of lucky six pets here soon so that we could be even luckier with our egg openings in the future. But as always, thanks so much for watching today's video. If you enjoyed, don't forget to drop a like, sub if you haven't already, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Deuces!